Good morning, student. Today we will study the lesson six, expert detectives. The story has half a dozen characters in it. Three of them are children: the narrator, his young brother Nishad, and sister Maya. They become expert detectives. Their mother is a doctor with her clinic. Mr. Nath, the principal. character and who lives in sanskar's house alone he is under her treatment ramesh takes a tea and meals from the restaurant to nath's room pay cash and also tips the children go ahead to collect information about nath they think mr nath is a mysterious person he has no friend here Nishad has a bit of sympathy for Nath. His approach in this case is sensible. The narrator is sure that Mr. Nath is an escaped criminal. Nishan is doubtful. He wants to discover the truth and he collects a lot of information in the case. The narrator has got a ready answers to all. Nishad's doubts. He thinks that Nath is a rich man. He had perhaps got millions of rupees locked in his room. He noted dark scars also on Nath's face. Nath might have got them during a shootout with the police. But Nishad contradicts him. Mummy had told that they were burn scars. One day, Nishad went alone to his mama's clinic at Girgaum. He gets upset to see Mr. Nath, who looked so thin, poor, and starving. He went to Nath's room and put a bar of chocolate. in nath's hand he collect one more clue about mr nath's routine ramesh told him that on every sunday he carried two lunches to mr nath's room and same visitor is with him each time a tall and fair visitor talks a lot but Mr Nath simply listened to him but he cannot imagine that Nath was a crook means criminal then Nishad thought Mr Nath was not criminal then he asked the question from Maya what do you think about Mr Nath he said that i thought he was look quite ordinary person then maya said that did you see the picture of the hyderabadi house breaker in the newspaper yesterday he also looked like any man on the street after listen these words nishad looked doubtful about mr nath then the narrator makes a long list of all the information they have collected about the target means mr nath he reads it out to the nishan first point they don't know what mr nath's first name so they must discover it second point the other tenants at shankar house say that mr nath is mad strange and unfriendly in nature third point he does not talk to anyone fourth point he is under mama's clinic treatment so he has to be polite to the children number 5 he has been living in room number 10 for more than a year number 6 he doesn't work to earn his livelihood number 7 the kids in shankar's house 
and some of the peoples are also scared of him. Eight point. He has no visitors. Only on Sunday, a fair white man comes to him for lunch. And last point. Food and tea are taken to his room by Ramesh from the restaurant distributor. Then Nishad does not pay much attention to the narrator's list of facts. He was only petty that the poor man was without any friend. The narrator argued that the Sunday visitor must be Nath's partner in crime. And comes on Sunday to give a part of money to Mr. Nath. As for Ramesh, Mr. Nath bribes him to keep quiet about his criminal activities. But Nishad doesn't quite agree with the narrator. He said he will not cooperate in their investigation. if they did not stop calling mr nath an escaped criminal in his opinion the purpose of their inquiry is to find out why mr nath is so thin and lonely he declared that he liked mr nath and he will try to befriend him but narrator laughed at the madness of nishad he warned him that the police would take him also to jail with his friend after that nishad walked out of the room quietly